It's the magic of math here, and today we're talking about a system of linear equations. Here is our question today. We are asked to solve the system of equations that is given right here, and to solve it, we're going to drag and drop into each appropriate box to complete the ordered pair that represents the solution to the system of equations. And each number, these numbers 1 through 8, may be used once, more than once, or not at all. So I'm going to ask you to pause the video now, solve the system, and select your solution. Come back and hit play when you're ready to check your work. Welcome back. So we are going to solve this system of equations using method called substitution. I'm going to pick substitution because I see that the first equation is solved for y, so therefore we know that y is equal to 2x subtract 4, and now we can substitute this in for y in the second equation, and then we will only have one unknown variable x that we can solve for. So let's start by rewriting our second equation. It's 3 times y, and we know that y is equal to 2x minus 4. So now we have our equation. We have variables on both sides. And we need to distribute. So let's solve for x. The first thing we're going to do is to simplify the left side by distributing. 3 times 2x is 6x, and 3 times negative 4 is negative 12, and that's going to equal 2x. Now I see that I have variables on both sides, so I have to collect those like variable terms to one side. Seeing as there is only an x term to the right, we're going to do the inverse to get this 6x to the right side of the equal sign. The inverse, or opposite of 6x, is negative 6x. What I do to one side, I must do to the other. So we're going to subtract 6x from both sides to create our zero pair, and we're left with negative 12, and 2x and negative 6x are negative 4x. Now, to solve for x, I'm going to do the inverse of multiply by negative 4 to isolate x, and I'm going to divide each side of the equation by negative 4. Negative 4 divided by negative 4 is 1, so I'm left with just x, 1x or x. Negative 12 divided by negative 4 is positive 3. So I know that this solution, the x coordinate, is 3. So I'm going to take this and go back to my original equation and replace x with 3 and solve for y. You could do it in either equation. I'm just going to pick the first one. So we're going to rewrite this so that it is y equals 2 times 3 because we know that when we want to know what y is equal to when x has a value of 3. 2 times 3 is 6. 6 subtract 4 is 2. So we know that the corresponding y coordinate to our solution is 2 when x is 3. So we're going to drag and drop our 3 to our x coordinate and drag and drop 2 to our y coordinate and the solution of our system of linear equations is the ordered pair 3, 2 when graphed, these two lines would intersect at the point 3, 2. And there you have it. That is how we solve a system of linear equations using the method substitution. I thank you for joining me today at The Magic of Math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. I hope you'll come back soon and have a great day.